post the Midnight Raven today. I thought with the lack of unboxings at the minute, um, I need to order some and that. And obviously with Christmas, I stopped all my unboxings in December. Um, I'm hopefully going to start ordering some more now so we can do some more unboxings come late January um, to February. So if you haven't already, check out all my unboxings I did in 2017. I will be bringing some more um, in the coming months. Um, I just need to order some. So if you haven't already checked out all my playlists and all the rest of my channel, um, I have been doing some different videos recently. I've done higher or lower. I've done the um, would you rather um, just to get some content out there still when I'm awaiting boxes. So today I thought I would bring you the A Little Something hand collection. Uh, these are hand creams. Um, there's six of them all together, so I thought I would bring and show these to you because they are so cute. You see them? Each one's got a different design, and I believe they all have different smells. Um, so these are hand creams. It says, discover a little something favourite in your hand cream collection. So I'm guessing these are all different ones. Um, this was £8.50 when I bought it, and I believe I bought it from Boots, I think. So it is really pretty and I do love the gold decoration and that each bottle is different. I will just open it. I hope you all had a nice Christmas um, and a good new year hopefully. Mine was alright. Um, I have recently loaded um, Picks from the last year, from when we went to Colchester Zoo, um, pictures from the Halloween experience at my house, um, also pictures from the sea life in Yarmouth, as well as the Crazy Gulf and loads of other little vlogs that I did, so I've uploaded the pictures for that, so check them out. So. They come like this. Whoa. I'll show you like this. Whoa. We've got six of them all together. So we'll go through each one and we'll see which each one is like. So we'll pick this one out first. I'll just move that out of the way. So this one, oh, it's a bit squashed. Comes like this. And they have these little screw caps. Like this. I like screw caps. They're all done up. Um, this one is called All Smiles Hand Cream. And they are all 30ml bottles. So let me see if I can find anything about these. So the All Smalls Hand Cream doesn't really give anything away on what it actually is. So we will just have to... Woo! <gasps> Whoopsie! Hang on. Just, just take a minute. So, I'll just get a little bit and we'll just put some on my hand. We'll use one finger at a time so that I can smell them all. Ooh, now that is a very, very fruity smell. Mm. Smells, smells like, it smells like when you were younger, your granddad would give you like those boiled sweets. They got that kind of sugary sweet smell to it, like bald sweets. I mean, it smells really nice. Um, everywhere. So that's really fruity um, as well. I really like that one. So that came like that. It's got nice simplistic design. So number two is the fruit on hands cream kind of got like kind of floral designs going on there so we'll have a look uh, oh it says on the back hang on the last one said a floral fruity fragrance with notes of rose gardenia and citrus gently massage into your hands so that was really nice it did say it smelled very sweet this one is a little fresh fruit notes of pink grapefruit, orange and mandarin. So we'll give it a go. Just a tiny bit on the other finger. I'll have smooth hands by the end of this video. 
Now that is like um, a really, really light smell. Like you can only just smell it. I guess if you slather your hand in it, obviously I'm only using a, a tiny amount. You can really smell the sort of, it's like a, it's like a play between the two. You can smell the sweet smell of like, like the grapefruit kind of thing. But then you get like a hint of the flowers in, so it's sort of a nice monotone kind of smell. They're not overly powerful, which is cool. The next one is called Gold Together, and it's got a cute little spotty design there. This one is a floral fragrance with notes of amber, bergamot, and lemon. So this should have a nice kind of citrusy aroma, maybe, with the lemon. I'm not really sure of what bergamot smells of. Um, I can't say I've ever used bergamot before. What was the other one? Amber. No idea what amber smells of. So we'll try this one on the third finger. Give that good rub in. Ooh. Well, you can definitely smell lemon. It's got that kind of citrusy kind of aroma. It does smell really nice. Very nice. Loving these. So glad I got myself these. Next we have the So Wonderful hand cream. Again, nice, gorgeous design. Very nice, simplistic tubes. Next, this one is the floral fruity fragrance of notes of jasmine, bergamot and citrus. I do love jasmine. So, just take a tiny bit. Ooh, this one's got a very, very, it's like a smell of the Orient, that kind of jasmine. It smells absolutely gorgeous. It reminds me of like, it reminds me of like incense candles or incense sticks. It's got that nice undertone of the bergamot and then you get the real nice floral smell as well of sort of, Jasmine is, oh, it's, it's gorgeous. These are really nice, I must say. So the next one is the Sugared Dreams. Again, lovely design, very simplistic, but very effective. Then we have a sweet gourmand, or gourmand fragrance with notes of caramel and vanilla. Ooh, so maybe we'll smell like a sugar cookie. <laughs> These tops on the top here, they're awful. They hurt your fingers to open it. If they just had a round cap, it would have been better. I'm not a fan of these. I'll show you what I mean. They're sort of like that. And when you try and turn them round, they hurt your finger. Look. So what were we saying? Yes, we were saying that these is a caramel and vanilla. Ooh. This should smell absolutely gorgeous. I'm expecting a caramel sweet with a like an undertone of vanilla, maybe not too strong. Well, we'll see. Vanilla can be sometimes overpowering in stuff. Hmm. I can smell a hint of vanilla, but it's not over. I can't smell caramel. For the caramel, I expected that kind of burnt smell, you know, like the, the sugar sweet caramel, but no, that's a very light aroma of the vanilla. No, it's just vanilla. I wouldn't say there's caramel in there, unless it's very, very subtle. And the last one is the citrus pop, which has this gorgeous bright green. I mean, look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. I do love the packaging and the box itself is very very shiny as well this obviously from my guess will probably be lemon and lime or lime and something it's a fresh zesty fragrance with notes of pomelo and pineapple Ooh, pineapple see i thought they were going to go for the sort of lemon and lime sort of thing I can't actually get it undone. I can't get it undone. 
Hang on a minute. Let me come back. Right, I'm back. I actually got it undone now. God, that took some doing. I don't know who screwed that on, but jeez. I don't know. My poor finger is literally been maimed. So, as we were saying, this is meant to be pineapple. See, I thought they would go, like I said, for the traditional lemon and lime kind of zesty. Because it said zesty. I just assumed it would be lemon and lime. And with the colours as well, I guess. Lemon and lime. I thought maybe the two different sort of colours. But no, it's pineapple. And pomelo. Might have to Google what that is. Um, so we'll put this one on the middle of my hand. Because we've already used my five fingers. And there's six in this, so. Oh, that's definitely pineapple. You can definitely smell that nice zing of pineapple. I don't know what the pomelo smell is meant to be. But all I can smell at the minute is pineapple. And it smells gorgeous. So my hand now smells like a floral flute. A floral fruity bouquet. Like. I have super smooth hands now with six of them, but that's going to smell all day now. They're really gorgeous. So, just to recap, uh, it was £8.50 from Boots. I don't know if you can still get it, um, but I want to bring you a review anyway. Um, if not, it's called a Little Something Hand Cream Collection. Um, so, this is actually made by Boots. So, I don't know if you can still get it or not, but it's a Little Something Hand Cream Collection. So all in all, for eight pounds or eight fifty, I think it was, we got six of the hand creams. We have the fruit on, which is the pink grapefruit and orange. We have the so wonderful, which is the jasmine, bergamot, and citrus. We have the pineapple one, which was the pop citrus. We have the Sugar Dreams, which is a vanilla and caramel, which actually smells more of vanilla. We have the Gold together, which is the bergamot, amber and lemon. Again, I couldn't smell the amber because I'm not really known. If you haven't smelt something before, you won't necessarily pick it up, I find. And this one was probably my favourite, was the Rose and Gardenia one. I, Gardenia must be a really nice flower because that Rose and Gardenia and then just that little citrus at the end so you get six of them and they all smell gorgeous I must say my favorite has got to be the gardenia and rose and my least favorite would probably be the sugar dreams because I can't smell the caramel in there so if you haven't already I would love if you'd like and subscribe to my channel give me a thumbs up if you liked this video leave a comment down below if you bought this set yourself and what you think of it or you can also comment down below on what hand creams you use because I find that my hands are really drying out in this cold when you can you can hear they are literally <laughs> dry as anything. I'm now going to go use these and lather up my other hands so that both hands end up super soft. So you have you haven't already, check out all my playlists, all my unboxings. Like, subscribe, thank you to everyone for watching and subscribing in 2017. Hopefully my channel will get bigger and more subscribers in 2018. Thank you to everyone that's been watching. Like, subscribe. I'll see you very soon for another video. Take care and thanks for watching. Bye.